Hey there, welcome back to another video. I am Kira, and as usual, we're here today playing some ARK Survival Evolved Mobile. And currently it is pouring with rain on the ARK map, but that's fine. And today, I am planning on taming up, oh how perfect is that, a Pronto. One spawned right beside base. A level 35. Definitely an option. For the meantime though, I'm just going to show you what you'll probably need to tame one up. So, first of all, I suggest using a long neck rifle. And then along with that, some tranquilizer darts. And I do have some vegetables here. Um, Brontos do prefer Carbonemi's kibble, I have no idea how to pronounce that, the turtle kibble, but vegetables are second best, and then also I have some narcotics, 18 times soothing balm, and a saddle for our new Bronto when we find one. So now I'm just questioning if 35 is high enough, so female. Oh, and that's a Quetzal. Level 45. And I do have to make sure if I do tame this Bronto to keep it away from my base. Because all my Species X plants will in fact start shooting it. So let's just have a look at this guy. Is also female. Perhaps we should find a male Pronto just in case. You are already tamed up. Typical. Normally Brontos aren't so hard to find. They're quite common on the map and generally quite easy to spot because of course they are ginormous. But for the time being, I'll go searching the map and I'll bring you guys back in just a second. Okay, so I have found a little male here. Only a little 20, but that's fine. So now what I need to do is find a cliff because the easiest way to tame a Bronto is to shoot it from on top of a cliff so it cannot reach you. Perhaps this one might be good enough. Maybe not, it can probably climb up there. Oops, now I've lost it. Where did it go? Oh, over there, there we go. So in fact, what I'm going to do is probably shoot it now while I am on a griffin. Could be a bad idea. Boom. And then hopefully it will follow us over here. In fact, they're not very fast. I can probably start shooting it from there. Except for when my game plays up. There we go, it fixed itself. Or I was thinking these rocks, it might get trapped on these rocks, so it might be a good sort of sheltered area to start shooting. And it won't let me pull out my gun, so I will just quickly relog and be right back. Okay, so back to where we were. So I just want to sort of hide behind rocks. And then I guess start shooting it up. And then of course it will get grumpy. And we just sort of have to hope that these rocks... Oh my gosh, it's going to totally climb over that, isn't it?
And that's a bad idea. All right. Not to worry. Oh my gosh, if it would even let me on my griffin. There we go. Oh, and here's another one over here. What level are you? Level 70 female. Oh, typical. So we have to lead it somewhere where it probably cannot get us. Probably over here, actually. Or perhaps if you do have a griffin, you can probably just sort of shoot from the sky. Well, it's extremely difficult, I find. Come on, buddy, over here. And it is getting dark now, unfortunately. Catch me if you can. Preferably you would find one already close to a cliff. Alright, it's following now, so let's just set up shop up here. And hope we can reach it. currently being attacked by something. Surely, surely it can't climb that. Don't get smart. Is it already running? Oh my gosh. I hope that thing didn't kill it. Or I should say not kill it, but remove most of its health. Don't tell me it. <sighs> it had to go unconscious under the river. Of course it did. typical although it's not losing oxygen oh those are not good though that is not good perhaps I can lead them away after all, we don't want to hit the Bronto. It's already probably damaged enough. Oh my gosh. Let me hit you. Alright. So let's see this guy. Is his oxygen lowering? Luckily it is not, so let's start taming him up. Oh, except there are too many teams on the arc right now. So I'll bring you guys back after I have managed to get the taming process started. It may take a few minutes for someone to sort of kill off an unused dinosaur. But regardless, we will be right back. Well, this is just great. I have no campfire around me to get this stupid thing off. Look how gross they look. Just, you know, pumping away on my heart. I honestly, I don't know any other ways to get it off. 
torch doesn't work either. Interesting. I just thought I'd quickly show you this. We're still not able to tame it up yet. I know when they're on a creature, you can just sort of pick them off. Let's see how much wood I need to make a quick campfire. Campfires get them off pretty fast, generally. And of course I have none of it. Thatch, flint, stone and wood. Let me see if you've got any of that. No, you don't. Um, I do not. Oh, it was you. Okay then. So let's just quickly start getting off this leech before it totally kills me. All right, let's see what we can do now. Okay, now please, they are so gross. I just can't believe how gross they are. That would be like my worst fear in the real life. Um, that one will do. So here you go guys, if you ever want to know how to get rid of a leech, just Step on a campfire. If you will let me on the campfire, oh my gosh. There we go. Thank goodness for that. We are in fact all clean now. I really wish you could see the dead leech on the ground, but unfortunately it never does that. Okay, so we don't need that anymore. Too many tamed creatures on the Ark. <sighs> That's what I get for playing on an official server where everything is always full. Hopefully it should come down soon though. I'm just really surprised it's not drowning. Its head is fully under the water. But nope, it hasn't lost any health since it's been down and it is full of oxygen. Oh my gosh. I'm looking at my own stuff. I got a bit of a fright then. Oh, and then of course there's the piranhas everywhere. Have to keep them from attacking. So yes, the oxygen is still at 165. Shouldn't be too long now, so again, I will bring you back in just a minute. Alright, at long last we are back. It has been a solid 45 minutes since I've been waiting for this time limit to sort of die down a bit. I had to ask someone to unclaim something. So quickly before it goes back, we'll quickly feed it a balm. And because it is half empty, its food bar is half empty, it will eat extremely fast. So we should just pop it in. And it should tame up sort of quickly. There we go. Sorry if you can hear my dog snoring in the background. I just can't believe how long that took. <sighs> Definitely the cons of being on an official server. But here we go. We have finally tamed it up. And we can take all of that now. And put on its pink saddle, of course. Finally, all right. Okay, so we can turn that off. Or I guess just keep it going. Just in case a little beach bob comes along. There we go, and it's back to too many tames. But that's fine because we finally, finally, finally got to tame a Bronto. Super easy to tame. Let me see if I can just all oh, stop that. So 
super easy to tame. And now maybe in a future video I can breed on this server. Let me just collect some berries. Definitely the most efficient berry gatherers, that's for sure. Or oh, even some wildflowers. And I only have eight dust. But we shall continue to make it pink. Because it wouldn't be mine if it wasn't pink. And there you have it guys. That is pronto taming. And my griffin is attacking something. So there you have it. I hope you enjoyed this video. It was definitely a huge pain to film because of that time limit. But anyway, for now, I'm Kira, and of course, you've been watching Kira Games.